Hello everybody, this is High Treason here. Um, this is Let's Play Shadow Warrior. I know it's been a while. Uh, I have a 3D effects card in here, I was going to use it, but it doesn't want to work today, which isn't uncommon. So we're just going to go with this, the original Shadow Warrior. Oh, it looks like DOS mode! <laughs> oh man, I'm going to be a bit rusty on commentary, I think, but uh, we'll try. <laughs> you no mess with Lo Wang! Yeah, what have I let myself in for? Hmm. You see, if I do it on difficult level 2, I can probably get this whole episode done in one video. Um. Uh, Want to some way. Screw it. Let's go hardcore. Zula sins his regards. <laughs> right. Ancient Chinese secret. Playing this game, it's not that dissimilar to Duke Nukem 3D. If you can play Duke Nukem 3D, you can play this. But I have set up to use the uh, mouse framing. It's a bad habit that I've gotten into and uh, having a hard time getting out of it. I'm on a new microphone here, by the way, so um, you know volume levels are going to get adjusted every now and then until I figure out what's best with it. Um, let me know which microphone you prefer, because I can always put the old one back in if uh, you prefer me to use that. But, uh, yeah, I'm quite liking this new one. Jeez. Oh, it feels good to be recording again, though. It's just um, remembering to speak while I'm playing. <laughs> Yeah, I'm on a new mouse, it's uh, optical, and it's uh can't see a thing, goddamn glare. That doesn't look, um, that doesn't look horrible. Ooh. That's a nice TV station. If only that were a woman, man. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, nonetheless. Yeah, new mouse. This is Tekken, so I'm getting used to, because it's all optical and stuff, and... How is he not dead yet? I won't mind, we've got another one behind here that we have to deal with. Hey, check it out, I'm blue. What the hell? Ah, oh, I tell you, don't install a 3D effects patch, it just messes things up. Now them guys in there, we'll be there in a second. I'm not bothering to wipe them out yet. There's more medkits somewhere, I can't bother to find them. Maybe we'll just use that. Better than acupuncture. The only way I did a test for that, it blew me up. I'll probably insert that about here. Oh man! <laughs> what are the chances of that happening? Sucks! Yeah, so if I did, there you know, uh, there you go, uh, you know what happened now. I don't know what the chances of that happening were, but... If I didn't show it, basically it just came back out the door. I hate this one. Hate it. <sighs> Master Tempt. Finally, I got it. Bloody hell. Right, we have to go down here. There's a guy somewhere. There he is. I love the amount of interactivity this game has. It basically builds on what they already have with Duke Nukem 3D and takes it to a whole new level. It's just silly. You'd never get this from a game today. Oh man, the ghost usually die if you do that. Yeah, there's like a technique I had with uh, the ball mouse. Kawabunga. Where I'd kind of uh, knock it from one side to the other. And it doesn't work with optical mice, it's really taking me some getting used to. And that, I'm certain that that thing opens up, but I cannot for the life remember how to do it, so we're just going to leave this room alone for now. That could be useful. Ah, oh, cool, he always explodes where you go there. I didn't figure out where it actually was until yesterday. And I bought a new game. 
I uh, bought a couple of new games. I've got uh, Grand Theft Auto <laughs> episodes from Liberty City now. Um, I actually own that game now. And uh, I've got Crisis 2. What am I talking about? I own all games. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, i got Crisis 2 as well. And I'm not that pleased. I'm neither impressed by it, nor can I sell it on. Because basically, you take it into a game store and try to trade it in. Can't do it. They won't accept it, because it's got online activation. Yet they'll do it with most other games that have online activation, so... Oh, uh, uh. I don't know what their problem is with that one, but... You know, that's copyright Nazism for you. Once again, you attempt to stop piracy and only hurt innocent people. The thing is, you can't beat pirates, like I said. Uh, watch this. I don't approve of cheating, but this isn't a game-breaking cheat, really, so... Yeah. You can win them by chance, anyway, I just... Usually forget to pick that silver key up. But yeah, so I'm not impressed by Crisis 2. It's not even as good as the first one. I mean, neither of them are brilliant, but... The first one had better graphics, and the AI was more advanced. So less reliable. Yeah, that Shadow Ninja, if you turn your night vision on, is a little easier to see. So if he's still around here, I think we killed him though. I usually just jump up there to get away from him, if I don't spot him that early on. But yeah, not, not impressed. Rather play this. And I'm still going to finish Duke Nukem 2, haven't I? Bloody hell. This just there's this one level, I think it's the second level in, on the second chapter, that I just can't beat very well, I don't, it's bad, I don't want to upload it. In the end I might just leave that as a separate video, and just forewarn you all, like, hey this one sucks, skip it. That way I've completed, you know, I haven't cut anything out, but it's not like you uh, have to sift through it to find the decent stuff. I don't think I have any problems with the other levels. Now watch out, because there's going to be one that way as well. I think. I thought there was. I guess not. Let's get out of this first level. This took me ten minutes yesterday. There we go, we're doing better today. Always run out of ammo at the end, though. Yeah, You just got on, buddy. This no movie, Mr. Chan. I like this. Oh, must be American made. Well, if it was American made, it would actually be working, mate. I thought I'd press that. Guess not. I don't know what happened there. Stupid ninjas. There's only one thing better than a ninja. And that's a ninja pirate. I don't really like ninja pirates and I don't really like ninjas. I think pirates are just better. I mean who didn't want to be a pirate as a kid? Like, or at least thought pirates were cool. But I never gave ninjas any thought as a kid. I was like ninjas. No oh, man, those are boring. All those do is like stealth around and stuff. If ninjas was more like Lil Wang, then it'd be awesome. Um, don't like this because I know there's there's a landmine there. Yeah, you want to avoid that thing if you can. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll show you what it does.
That's what it does. I don't know as to whether it takes any health off, it's just like a flash bomb. But, um. The hell, I think I triggered the explosion in the next room. That guy's probably still it. No, guess not. Good lord, there's coolies. Used to creep me out a bit, these ghosts as a kid. By the way, they drip blood everywhere. <laughs> um. Oh, those stupid airborne robot drone things in Duke Nukem 3D that I don't like used to like drip blood and stuff in like the beta version of the game. Yeah. Hmm. No power. No, there's no power. Man, that sucks. <laughs> don't like the ghost, I really don't. There's always more ammo and stuff if you just look for it. I'm telling you, the lag is not fun. Right, we're about to have our first encounter with something not very nice. But you see that guy in the red pants there? Yeah. Look out, because he will fire missiles at you like that. I heard another ninja, I'm not liking it. Where is he? It's up here, isn't he? And that beeping would imply that there's a landmine around somewhere. You can go out there, but that way is difficult, so I don't highly advise it. Basically, I'd advise just running back through this section. There's stuff up here, isn't there? We'll save that for later. I've done better on ammo than I usually do. Yeah, there's a few things we can do. As you can see, we have that toolbox in our inventory there. You may remember this vehicle here with this American make. was broken. It works now. We've fixed it with the toolbox. So we can call Lil Wang Mr. Fix-It. Hey, no. Uh, peculiar. Japanese engineering. Just just not up to scratch, is it? I'm not having it. Next time I will buy an American make. It'll be a damn sight more reliable. It won't have broken down. <laughs> would have at least been more impressive. It would have gone faster or something, I expect. And been louder. And a V8 engine in there somewhere. Where's that ghost? Yeah, see what I mean? It's, you can use a portable med kit because there's like at least two of them in this level. I just had a thought. Ancient Chinese secret. Ancient Chinese secret. Now. It's time to have some fun. <laughs> yeah, where's... Uh-oh. I'm taking more hits than I thought I would. <laughs> oh, well. That was fun. In every room that we've already been in, you know, we still don't have any more keys after that, do we? It's that room there, we need a gold key for a door in there. And I always thought this bit was awesome. 
Yeah, it, it just no key? What? I'll go and make my own key then. I'll make this first. Right, it's got me a new gun. I wonder what comes out of here. Stupid lag. It's something to do with the CD audio, that. Actually, this, uh, yeah, it runs worse in 3D FX mode, so... Problem with the 3D FX card, I think, is that it came out too early. There you go. That's where that key goes that we just forged. <gasps> Uh-oh. I want to blow it up. Animal, you are no match for my human skill. <laughs> I don't remember there being this many coolies. Punch it. Man, look, Wang's awesome. We just obliterated that thing. It's a ghost. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely more awesome than Crisis 2. Yeah. Whoa, what have we here? That took eight minutes. Oh, I'm disappointed. <sighs> Seriously, doubt I've got time to do another level, do I? No, I don't. That's working out okay, though. You can see the monster count is quite high, 110 enemies in that last level, that's that's what we need. Uh, so yeah, I'm High Treason, and uh, this is Let's Play Shadow Warrior. Be sure to tell me which uh, microphone you prefer me using and everything. And uh, yeah, thanks for uh, watching, and thanks for subscribing. I notice I've got some uh, new subscribers since last time I did anything. So I'm not, I'm not being ignorant or out. And if I get things in my inbox, they don't necessarily show up. Like, i got a few friend invites. Um, still wondering whether to accept those or not. I probably will. Uh, it does no harm, does it? But uh, those don't show up on YouTube anymore if I get them, unless I go to my inbox manually. And I rarely check the uh, inbox for email that this is linked to. So if you send me something and I don't respond quickly, that's why, you know... Um, I will get around to it more than likely, unless I can't think, unless you send me a message or something I can't think of a way of responding, then maybe I won't, but uh, that's not likely to happen. If you get me talking, I find it hard to shut up, so... Anyways, I'm wittering on, aren't I? I'm High Treason, and I shall see you later.